town of Gilbert is, is right on the brink of greatness. And we have had many titles given to us, safest town, best town to raise a child. And as a, as a part of that and being best in class, we, we have some challenges. And because in our growth, we grew residentially, we need to grow our commercial piece and get ready for the final phase of our, of our build out. The things we're trying to do to, to really improve the fire department as it's, as it's currently configured, one of our council initiatives currently is to be a technology leader and make what we do better and more effective. In the Gilbert Fire Department, I think any fire department, they're, they're a mobile workforce. Uh, taking proven mobile technology and to bring that into the fire service and make these four-person crews uh, productive regardless of their location, uh, but still keep them on and in their service areas ready for their primary duty of fire response or medical response is where the innovation is. On this particular project, we've been able to lean pretty heavily on some IT staff that work with our police department. And they've been able to bring in uh, five years of mobile technology experience to our fire department right on day one. You really can't understate the medic's role, the, the people on the ground, both in IT as well as in fire. We have leveraged resources and skill sets within our organization that have allowed us to develop this project um, from start to finish and we will save thousands of dollars for this community, not only on the front end, but with recurring costs that you could expect with out-of-the-box out of applications. Today, the data network that we operate on is a RF or radio frequency network. We've established partnerships that allow us to put broadband technology in our vehicles, and, and from the time that we equip a vehicle with the new technology, the minute we turn it on for that vehicle, we're essentially making a 20-year leap um, in, in the use of technology and the capabilities that we provide the fire service or our crews. Arizona Quality Alliance was really the doorknob that got us into a collaboration with Intel. There is a partnership that Intel offers with the community to assist in volunteer hours by their specialists and their technicians to assist efforts and projects that might exist out in the public. Intel has been just a champion among community assets that has helped us to realize this one aspect of, of something that's, that has been so difficult for us to embrace and, and make work within the industry. I've worked with uh, the Gilbert Fire Department to help them with the requirements of the system that they would want and then take that system through the various phases of development. The ultimate goal at the end is really to develop a tool that the first responders can use uh, as part of their job. A uh, easy to use tool for first responders working in a harsh environment uh, whose first focus is to be caring for a patient and then secondary to be able to collect data on the scene. This project would not be possible without Intel's involvement. We were not in the position to go out and uh, contract a developer, um, particularly to the skill level that Intel has brought to the table for us as part of our budget. The technician that came from, from Intel, Patrick, was committed to this because he lives here in Gilbert. He felt an ownership and a vested interest in the outcome. Volunteering is a big part of my life. As Americans, it's probably part of our DNA. I think we're pretty giving people. And so it's, it just means a lot to be able to do that, to knowing that I'm affecting you know, my community here directly. Another application for technology is our inspections. And inspections have been just a, a, a really labor-intensive, paper-driven event. Safety surveys were designed to be conducted by fire engine crews. Our goal is to get to every business within the town of Gilbert on an annual basis. The technology we're utilizing now is helping us achieve our goals because it's making it a lot more efficient. The amount of inspections that we can do are 10 times more because we don't have to spend all our time doing the, the data entry that was done before. We've caught up with technology now and hopefully the platform that we're going to operate on will take us into the future. It's a much more efficient way of doing business. The broadband technology will support all of our business needs on on the street with our crews and our firefighters, and our crews become better at what they do because we're leveraging the technology. We will now be able to demonstrate truly what levels of service we're, we're providing, and it will be supported by data. The idea that we can take a bundle of data and sort and cross-tabulate and see how many times a particular event occurs at a time of day and increase our, our ability to respond at that time 
Can you imagine how much better we become when we can target, when we're data driven into these things outside of intuition? I think we're going to be better at what we do and I am absolutely positive that the outcomes are going to be better.